Hey guys, thanks for joining me and welcome back. So today I have a small haul for you. I'm gonna show you some tops that I've picked up from two different stores and I picked up some other accessories to go with it. Um, I've been shopping online at the old Value Vision or the old Shop NBC. It's called evine.com now, I've been shopping there. And I also went to my favorite place, the Rainbow Shop and I picked up some things from there. So that's the stuff I'm gonna show you and I'm gonna try on the tops so that you can see how it fits on my plus size body. Now, normally I'm a size 16, depending on the cut of the garment, I could be a 16 or an 18. And normally that puts me in the extra large range, or I'm sorry, in the 1X range. Puts me in the 1X range and so I can usually get a nice tailored fit if I get a, like a jacket, I'll get it in a 1X. And sometimes I have to size down if it's like a full cut top, I'll have to size down to maybe like a extra large. So anyway, I picked up some things. I'm gonna do a, a try on haul for you so you can see how it looks on my on my body type. And also I have a very full bust too. My, my bust size is 38 uh, double D cup. So that's, that's what I'm working with. But before I get started, guys, I'm gonna tell you about my hair because I know somebody's gonna ask me about the hair. You guys always ask me about hair, so I'm gonna tell you about it. This is an old wig that I've had for about, I would say, going on a year and a half now. I wore this a lot last year. I put it away towards the end of the year, and now I just pulled it back out. And as you can see, this is a synthetic wig, guys, and it is holding up beautiful. I have to say, that these vendors or the people making these wigs, the quality of the synthetic fiber has improved immensely. I mean, this actually looks like uh, human hair. It really does. And as a matter of fact, when my husband saw me in it today, he thought it was beautiful. And as a matter of fact, he thought it was a human hair wig. And um, so the name of this wig, this is it right here. And I'm not sure if I did a review on this wig. If I did, I'll try to link it below. But if not, I'll just run through the specs just now before I get started with the haul. The wig is a free tress equal wig. It says the luxury integration invisible L part wig. Invisible L part, they say it's hand tied. The, the color I'm wearing is a 1B. The style name is January. It says it's curling iron safe up to 400 uh, degrees. And uh, it has uh, combs in it. I'll tell you what the combs are because they're not in the traditional place. This is what this looks like. This is the tag that comes with January. There's one comb in the back. And then there are two tiny combs, guys, right here next to the part. Those are the only combs, and those combs are very tiny. As a matter of fact, I'm not even using them. The only comb I'm using is the uh, comb in the back. And as you can see from the diagram here, this is definitely one of the... Um, wefted design caps, where the, the hair is just sewn onto, a, the wefts are sewn onto a, a cap, and it shows you the L part uh, lace here, which is right here, and I just put a little bit of concealer there um, very quickly to keep the wig looking smooth and in place. Guys, I use my detangling brush right here. You guys have seen me talk about this brush before. You've seen me use this brush. I hope you've seen me use this brush. And this brush just keeps this hair nice and detangled. It does get a little tangly at the ends, not very much. That's why I say this wig is really well made. The hair fibers are just really just well made. It just doesn't tangle. This wig has never matted up on me. And it has a natural hair finish. Uh, it, the, the fibers look like human hair. And it looks like a very light, light yakky. In, in texture lightly not not a lot guys it really does this looks like pressed hair really and um, I love it all right guys so I just wanted to tell you about that wig and now I'm going to start with the top the tops I'm going to show you um, I got from evine.com guys I did have a fit problem when I shopped at the rainbow shop so I'm going to start with the clothing that I feel fit me the best and then we'll move on to the clothes that are just a little too big and I'm gonna size down, I'm gonna take those back. So right here is the first top, this beautiful embroidered neckline top. Uh, it has the stretchy neckline, guys, so you can wear this as a scoop neck or you can wear it drooped, uh, drooped, or you can wear it off the shoulder. Uh, yeah, and this is in black. 
and it's made from a nice material guys and it resists wrinkling really really nicely because this was shoved in my closet and when I pulled it out it just came out looking just really really nice uh, it has that embroidered neckline all the way around the top the name of this top is called Kate and Mallory. I don't know if you can see it guys, because I'm using a fixed lens today. Kate and Mallory, and my size is XL. At this top right here, I picked this up from evine.com. Again, the brand name is Kate and Mallory. Kate and Mallory. My size here is XL. And boy, this is so pretty, and this color is amazing. And as you can see, it has a little bit of, um, flounce or ruffle at the front and it continues on the sleeve the sleeve is a three-quarter length sleeve also uh, the material is lightweight it's sort of sheer so i mean if you see this and you like it you may want to wear another um top underneath but i mean i normally wouldn't i would just wear a dark colored bra the sleeve is finished off here with the opening a little vent right there can you see it yeah that's really nice. And it's same thing on uh, the other side, of course. I'll show you the sleeve again. And the ruffle or the flounce is tacked down so it won't be uh, flopping when you wear the uh, blouse. Um, the flounce does not continue around the back. The back is just uh, finished off with the elastic uh, back as well as the front. So you can wear this off the shoulder or you can wear it uh, like a regular top, let it fall around your neckline in a, in a like in a scoop fashion. But this is really nice. I'll probably wear these tops off the shoulder. But again, this is a beautiful blouse. It's lightweight. It's, it's reminds me of organza a little bit. But this is really, really, really nice. So this top here I got from the Rainbow Shop, guys. And let me get started with the size. The size here is a 2X. Again, like I said, I normally wear a 1X. So I know when I shop at Rainbow Shop, that I have to size up, so I usually get a 2X, which is usually a good fit. Not not this time, guys. This Well, first of all, let me just show you how pretty this is. This color is really, really nice. And look at the sleeves, guys. The sleeves are long, but look how lovely the sleeves are. This is so nice, so beautiful. The color, this is a light cotton material, cotton blend, I would say, and uh, I just wanted to show you that sleeve again. Really nice, just beautiful. Really, really nice. But look really nice with a black skirt or a black pair of pants or jeans. I guess you can wear it with jeans or you can wear it with a skirt. Uh, the neckline is elasticized again so that you can wear it off the shoulder or you can wear it as a regular top. But this is a beautiful blouse, but it's too big. This is a peach colored top or a blush colored guys this is so beautiful um, this is like the color of the summer I think everyone wants to get at least one thing in a blush color this is absolutely beautiful uh, this again let me just show you the sleeve is a wide sleeve so if you have a fuller arm uh, you definitely could accommodate a fuller arm but it just falls beautifully when I when I wear it it just looks so beautiful so the next few things that I picked up are from the rainbow shop so let me just show you I picked up these cute little slides faux fur slides cute and they look like the old Nike slides that came out a couple years ago guys and then everyone started covering it up with faux fur. Remember that on um, YouTube? I've seen a couple of people do that on YouTube. Well, this looks like that, really does. But it's, again, that blush color that, I mean, it's just really popular. And the, it's faux fur and it's very soft. And underneath it, there is a, like a like a felt lining. So it could be nice and soft against your, your feet. Now, guys, when I picked these up, when I got to the checkout, the checkout girl said, did you try them on? And I said, no. And she said, you know, you may want to size up because these, these are running a little on the small side. And I said, okay, because she said she had them. So I went, I went back, picked up the next size up. I wore a size nine, I picked up the 10, picked up the 10. And when I got home, guess what guys? They're too big. Not only are they too big, but they're wide. So my feet look like, like a daughter playing in her mother's shoes. If you can, you know, like a little kid playing in her mother's shoes. <laughs> so 
So I'm saying, uh, no. So I have to take that back. But when I got these guys, I got back to go with this top because I felt like these these two items together with a nice pair of black um, black pants or a white white skirt or white jeans in the summer, I thought it would have been really a nice look. But again, like I said, these are too big, so I'm gonna have to take I'm gonna have to take everything back. Everything that I bought has to go back except for this guys the chokers <laughs> I didn't try them on they're still on the little card but I picked up these two chokers uh, this one was $4.99 this one was four dollars this is a faux leather and clear sequence on this one really nice and you just put it on and you tie it lace it up in the front the way you see it here I thought that was cute to wear and then the next one I got was these three uh, cute little thin chokers. Gold right here. The gold is pretty. The black, which is like black beaded. That's really cute. And then this little thin pink lace. This is really nice. And you, they hook up together with the chain. And uh, yeah, I got that. And um, I thought they were cute. So I'm keeping that. But I'm taking the other things back. I guess I'll take them back tomorrow. Um, yeah. So that is it, guys. That's it for my haul. So that is all that I have right now. I don't have anything else to show you. I do have some wigs that I want to show you guys. And I do have my uh, Sephora VIB Rouge haul. If you're interested in that, there's some surprises in that haul. But if you're interested, let me know. And um, I'll leave it in the comment section. And uh, yeah. So guys, please don't forget to thumbs up my video and please don't forget to subscribe. And thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate it, guys. You take care. You be blessed. And I'll see you at the next video. Bye-bye.